girl, are you ready? The real Andy of Beverly Hills is here to spill all the tea. So let's talk about this mess. It's time to give a shout out to our partners of this video and are the beautiful people of Jibu Beauty. They have an amazing skincare collection that will make your skin and your soul look amazing. Their personal mission in life is to make your skin glow. From the Super Duo to the Multitasking Tint Moisturizer to even their new Enchanted Bloom collection, everything that they offer is just perfection. So if you want to get your products, make sure to go to the link on the description below and do not forget to use my discount code ANDY15 and you will get between 15 and 20% off. So get your products right now. Jibu Beauty, inspired by dreams, made for reality. Hello Beret Troop, welcome back, I'm the real Andy of Beret Hills and welcome to another piece of tea of the day and girl, it is time to talk about the real housewife of New York. Girl, I still cannot believe that we are finally, you know, talking about the real house of New York and the capacity of like tea and where things are going on out there, like honestly, I for a very long time I thought that that was it you know that last season was going to be the last one and that was going to be pretty much it but these new girls mm, 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 they are bringing the hit i mean they are so good at what they're doing you know and i am really really learning to appreciate every single one of them i did the recap of the last episode yesterday so make sure to check that out because i i mean i love to talk about these girls so anyways, um, after the episode on Sunday, you know, Watch Happens Live, Saida Silva was there with Kenya Moore. And let's say that they just spilled so much of that good tea. And one part was, you know, the, uh, the questions from the, uh, from the audience or the online audience, whatever. And they were talking about the extent, the... the you know, exchange, that's the word, Latino moment, guys. The exchange that Saida Silva had with Ramona Singer. Now, if you remember last time that Sai was on Watch Happens Live with all of the other cast of The Real House of New York, the new one, she said that she, that Ramona Singer was a very, very uh, rude to her when they met each other that basically ramona dismissed her completely like it wasn't until Sai at the very end kind of like say like hey i'm actually on the remake you know and ramona was pretty much like oh good luck you know like she was very yeah you know how ramona hates everyone you know she's a little you know ball of hate and say that say said that <laughs> on what happens live you know now these people you know ask Sai if you know they have he she has her anything from her since that exchange Sai was like i'm no i haven't really heard anything from her you know and andy mm, shady shady andy coin of course he come forward on what was and he was like well i have she reached out to me and she brought the receipt and everyone was like oh what do you mean ooh 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 you know well the receipts were whack okay like they were so dumb so apparently she sent a conversation to andy cohen where she said like well actually i have a, a, a whole interaction with sai and we actually end up in an amazing note like i don't know what she's talking about and <laughs> that was what kind of like what andy cohen was kind of saying thank god that sai is that bitch who will keep the receipts and she is like, oh, you want to bring the receipts? Okay, let's bring the receipts. Let's see how this actually went. And she pulled up her phone and she showed everyone the conversation that she had with Ramona Singer and how basically it was a nothing, you know, and how, uh, I mean, literally it was like two messages or something. I think Ramona actually was the one who reached out to Sai first. And then Sai said, 
thank you, so nice meeting you. And then it was no response at all. Like literally Ramona left her on read. I mean, girl, I am not surprised. We all know how Ramona Singer is, you know? We all know that she is probably the rudest housewife ever walk on this earth, you know? And I think, of course, like add to that the shame and the frustration that she's no longer a housewife and the fact that the reboot is being utterly successful, you know? So I think she must be feeling all kind of ways. And she has not been really asked to be back. I, th I mean, she's going to be back on the Ultimate Girls trip, but that's not airing until like 2024 at some point. So, yes. Let's just say that we still have like a long, a, a long time before we see Ramona ever again. So I feel like she, I mean, she doesn't care. She doesn't care. She probably doesn't even remember who Saida Silva is. You know, that's how rude she is. I love that Kenya was there. And Kenya was like, oh, you have a bad interaction with Ramona Singer? And she just like started laughing and she's like, what's new? What's new? Like, like girl, like everyone has had a bad interaction with Ramona Singer. Actually, if you remember the first episode, you know, when Sai said everything the first time, literally, I think Jen Alliance and I want to say Erin, someone else. I don't remember who's the other person. They, I think Uba. I don't remember, also had bad interactions with Ramona Singer, you know? So this is, the, I mean, this is the deal. This is what it comes with the territory, you know? Anyway, so that's the team. So yes, there were receipts, but the receipts were dumb AF, you know, because there was no conversation. If anything, the receipts actually show how rude Ramona actually was. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, yeah. So, let me know what you guys think on the comments below. Do you expect less from Ramona? I don't know. Let me know. And if you want to get all the tea related to The Real Housewife of New York or any of the other Bravo shows, make sure to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, guys. Remember, I have a new podcast. It's called Let's Talk About This Mess with The Real Andy of Berry Hills, dropping episodes every Monday with very special guests and very exclusive tea. Girl, actually, I literally just dropped an episode yesterday, okay, with David Jantef from Behind the Velvet Rope. It was a lot of fun. We actually talk about New York a little bit on there. So make sure to check it out. It's on Patreon. The link is on the description below. And I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.